Hey there, Riddle 5th graders. Welcome to another video art lesson. We've been real busy making lots and lots of drawings. Last week we actually made Garfield. That was a very difficult one. Uh, we did Eeyore. That was also difficult. And we did the Cardinal Bird, which was much easier. Um, sometimes when it's hard to draw something, uh, it's important to just think of it in shapes and, and make one shape at a time and add to it and use that eraser if you see that something doesn't look right. It's actually a lot of measuring that is what you're doing. It's a lot of math with your with your eyes. You're comparing the sizes of shapes and how far you're measuring, how far certain lines go. Um, so it's, it's sometimes it's not easy, but if you can see that something doesn't look right, then you are, are actually equipped and prepared and you could fix it. So we're gonna use the art card again, and we're gonna start with an oval shape, and we're gonna be drawing a Scooby-Doo. So I start with an oval, here's the middle. Middle. And I'm gonna put in the middle a very large nose shape. A classic cartoon sort of a nose. Next, I'm going to go straight down from the nose and I'm going to curl out to make the mouth. Well, to make the mouth. That's what I just did there. Next, I'm going to make a mouth open. So right at the bottom here, I'm going to just make a little U shape. Make a little tongue inside. Make a little bit of a jaw. A little line here for his bottom jaw. I'll show you. That's just his lip. That little line's his lip. I'm going to make the jaw. And this line is going to go all the way around here. Just like that. Next. I'm going to look at his eyes. His eyes are up a little bit higher. They're not right on top of the nose. Something like this. Then I go a little bit higher up and I can make the top of his head. Yeah, it's about right there. He's got two Big um, eyebrows. And then I'm going to make his ears. Something like that. Next, from his ears, I'm going to come down and make the side of his head. In this ear, I'm going to curl down. Let's make his neck. He's got two little hairs there, don't he? He's got three little freckles on his nose, on, or by his nose there. Yeah, something like that. I come down, and then it's going to be the dog collar. Just going to draw it. Two stripes, three stripes, and the, the hoop. Yes, the Scooby Doo. His little dog collar. Next, make his shoulders come down. And his arms. That's, uh, much what it looks like right there. 
Next, I'm gonna start with the color, I suppose. He is kind of a teal. Ooh boy, to make a teal. His dog collar's got some teal on it. Teal's kind of a little bit of a baby blue and a little bit of green. So I suppose I'll just throw down some of the blue. And put some green over top of it and hope that it looks kind of teal looking, and it does. Next, I guess I'll do the pink inside of his ears and the gold on his pink in his ears, yep, yeah. and his tongue's pink, yep. Yeah. his nose black right now. I'll make the inside of his mouth. Black. Big bushy eyebrows. Black. They look like little caterpillars. He has no caterpillars are I hope. He does have a couple Spots. I'm just going to color in black too right now. And then uh, I'm ready to do some brown. It'd be nice if I had a nice light brown. I don't really have a light brown. I got pretty dark, but we'll just go with it. I'll just color kind of light. Still want to see my pencil lines anyway, so and then I'll have to go over those pencil lines with a black so I can see it. Sometimes drawings work out, sometimes it doesn't. It takes a couple tries. your best and want to see how it turns out. If you can see, like I've, I've already said, if you can see that something doesn't look right, you can erase and try again, see what will happen. We go over all these lines now with the black, it's going to really help a lot. He does have whisker, don't he? Nope. That line is, I guess it would be called the dog tag, right? Here we do, here we do, here we do, raggy. What for the background? In Scooby-Doo, there's a lot of lime green. So I'm just going to go ahead and throw down this green. Shaggy shirt is a lime green in it. Scooby-Doo's a pretty older, much older show too, older cartoon. We were watching that when I was little, for sure, and I felt like it was already old when I was watching it, as there are some old um, actors and actresses in it as guest characters and such. Oh yeah. Hey, Raggy, Rubenax. Let's see what you can do. I look forward to seeing it.